Certified Hustler here, E-Money here, and today we're gonna go hit garage sales. Should be a lot of fun. I wanna take you guys with me. Let's go. What's going on guys and gals? Chris Bonafide Hustler coming to you live from the inside of E-Money Spaceship. We are cruising at zero miles an hour and we're about to go hit up our first garage sale. It's a 7 a.m. garage sale. This is what we do to make extra spare money on the weekends. We flip used items from garage sales and thrift stores primarily. Then put on places like eBay, Amazon, Craigslist, my antique booth, other consignment avenues in town as well. So let's go to our first garage sale. Uh, it is 6.50 in the morning. Beautiful day I think in Austin, Texas coming down today and it's gonna be great. My neighbor. Hi, neighbor. First garage sale of the morning is right here. It looks huge. It does kind of look low quality though, I ain't gonna lie. But, you know, at seven in the morning, you really can't be super picky, so we're gonna check this one out. E-Money, what'd you yeah. get? Oh, I got it right here. Sweet. I'm gonna cut open your eBay boxes. Maybe you should chop the top off this Tacoma. Mm -hmm. All right, you ready? And you're stupid. What is wrong with you? We got eBay packages going out. Uh, shoes are in one of them. Uh, one of those boxes has an $11 boot that sold for 109 yesterday. So yeah, that's sitting in one of those boxes. Let's go to the next garage sale, which is in Central Austin. Yes, let's go to Central, <laughs> let's go. Come on. So those lightsabers right there, he picked them up for like basically nothing. Um, they're not Force FX, they are 2010 Hasbro ones, and sometimes you can get those 2010 Hasbro lightsabers sold for around 45 to around 55 bucks. Um, you definitely want to check them out and everything like that. A lot of times they'll have corrosion. So, the ones you want to really look for are the Force FX ones. Those are awesome. Those are typically over $100 sales every single time. And they feel like more aluminum based, like handle, like it just feels quality, like a, like a real lightsaber. I know what that feels like. All right, next garage sale is sitting right here. Sun's coming up, looking really, looking like an amazing day. About to start, ooh, this garage oh, sale looks interesting. Yeah, man, some people beat us here. It's crazy. All right, so uh, this one, you know, it's in Central Austin. We'll check it out. You can't, it's behind some trees, but it's there. You want me to back up all the way? All right, we didn't find anything there. Okay, so there's another reseller there. He's kind of, it's kind of odd. And he goes up, he's like kind of going around real fast. And he's like, you got any bikes? And the lady's like, no, no bikes today. And he goes, what about plants? Got any plants? <laughs> Got any plants for sale? Worst hustle ever. Don't hustle plants. You got any plants? No. Hey, you do you want any... me to back up? You got any bikes? Yes. This is this is if he was looking at you and you're the lady, it'd be like this. Hey, you got any bikes? What about plants? What about plants? <laughs> <laughs> All right, there is another garage sale. It's one that I actually did not want to go to on my list, but Imani wants to go on his list, so well, we'll go check it out. It's back there. It's behind that house where the balloons are. Let's go check it out. Dude, your camera sucks. Is good? All right, go. All right, so I spent three bucks. I found this Chun Li Street Fighter 4 controller. I don't know what it goes to, but I'm gonna, you know, I'm gonna pop on it because I'll do my research <coughs> later. Not a huge deal if it's a dud. I did get this GT Spoiler 2 vintage skateboard though that's pretty cool so i don't know what this will sell for but i'm gonna mess with it for a little bit in my cul-de-sac and then uh probably kill myself and then i'll sell it uh it'll probably i don't know I you don't can't know. sell it after you're dead yeah that's true uh i don't know i have to look it up but it could be you know 30 dollars skateboard could be a 50 dollars skateboard What's that? uh this is something that i'm gonna sell today i think this is my slr camera that i don't need anymore so i'm gonna sell it to somebody on craigslist all right Sitting here at Thunderbird, kind of admiring this Toyota truck that's outside. I think it's awesome. We're gonna get a coffee in here, or a dopio, or something. Hey buddy, hey buddy, you little Falcor, hey buddy. So we got our dopios, our next garage sale is like really close. Let's go knock these out. They're fresh off the press. That's something we can actually say because they were pressed. Power breathing into my dopio. All right, cheers. Ah! Mm, it's 
good. It's really good. Ah! It's a two for me. It's not more than a two. It's a little sour. I was about to ask you if it was. Does it make your cheeks like mm. kind of cinch up? This is so good, but not so good. You know, it's a two. I'm ready to take control of my day. Let's go. The garage sale right here. I have high hopes for this one. A lot of cars, oh my gosh. Yeah, I think this one might be pretty good. Man, there are a million people here. What? Oh gosh, there's so many people. Where are you gonna park, man? There. Oh gosh. Oh, that thing's huge. You can tell, there's just commotion everywhere. And like thrift, oh, I see resellers. Look at all these resellers. I see resellers. Come on inside, resellers. All the resellers in town. And oh, they're having their meetup. Yeah, they are. <laughs> I guess it's like, it's the blue room meetup right here. All right, that garage sale was freaking awesome. Check out what we got. Um, check out what we got. I've spent $25. Got this climber manual. Anytime you see climber manuals, you should definitely check them on FBA. But yeah, that's pretty cool. Um, I haven't gone sour on a single climber manual yet. So anyways, this is probably bring like 15 to 25-ish, something like that. Got this, I haven't even looked it up, but this is part of the deal. I remember I spent 25 on everything. Screaming Hand Santa Cruz socks. I like those. Those are made by Stance, that's more current day. Got some games right here that I'll probably play, but then I'll also throw into my PS3 when I actually like flip it, you know? And there's one Xbox 360 game in there. A bunch of, you know, vintage cap guns and stuff. Pretty interesting, we got a Daisy in there, some other randoms. Uh, some Secret Wars 1984 unopened caps. And then I think the real big win here are these belt buckles. 1978 Leonard Skinner belt buckle right here. Still 1978 Pink Floyd Wish You Were Here belt buckle. You know, these are all TBD. What's it gonna sell for? Don't really know, but I know these are gonna be pretty good wins. $25 for everything here. Super score. Let's go to the next garage sale. E-Money, you got a Vulcan. How much you spent? 15? 15. You got a Vulcan, two climber manuals, something like that? A video uh, game manual? One Chilton manual. Oh, Chilton manual, okay. Okay, and a uh, Pokemon, like, uh, handbook. What else? And three GameCube controllers. Damn. Score. Hey, so are you gonna, what are you gonna sell those GameCube controllers for? I'm going to bundle them up with a GameCube whenever I find one for like a buck or something at a garage sale. Okay. Next garage sale is down here. This one, we probably will find something, I would think. This is a pretty big moving which sale. Side? It's somewhere down the street. I don't know which side, but it's around here, E-Money. So, uh, that's, I see the sign. Park here, oh, there it is. park here. Yeah, oh, that look, this looks great. This looks huge. All right, let's go check this one out. All right, nothing there, but uh, some tree dropped some goodies on E-Money's car. And it was sticky stuff. You know what I've noticed? What'd you notice? Like, whenever I take my truck out, I always get bird poop on it or something. So I always end up cleaning off my truck. Dang, E-Money, you got good luck. All right, we're going to a Goodwill real quick. Uh, so we just came from this Goodwill over there. I didn't even film the come up with the Goodwill. I'm doing a really bad job vlogging today. I'm sorry. Um, but anyways, found this Bell helmet. This is a, a triathlon helmet or a time trials helmet. Uh, essentially, it makes the, uh, when the rider's head is down real tight into the bars and they're on a bike, it's the air to move right over the head and go right down the back. So that's what, if you ever see a helmet like this, don't be thinking uh, Xenomorph. Was that the name? Yeah, Xenomorph. Xenomorph from yeah. Aliens or anything. This is actually a uh you know a triathlon or time trials helmet this is a bell meteor 2 it was ten dollars local sale around 40 50 but on ebay it could probably fetch for like 70. it does right. look like a meteor 2. it does kind of look like a shooting huh. star get it thing. Huh. meteor 2. um so this was some ultra boost uh, adidas shoes in my size these are really nice i don't know if they've been painted down here if they were painted down here it's a really good job a lot of times they come white Anyway, so these are like black on 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 punk him real hard. I'm like, hey, e money you see that over there? He's like, yeah. I'm like, you know what color it is? He goes, what? And I'll go, it's black on black on black on black. And I'll go like 30 times saying that and he like starts laughing real hard. Anyways, so that's what these shoes are and that's the reason why he started laughing. Um, these are my size. I'm gonna probably keep them. Wait, what size are they? These are size 12. They're always size 12. They're always, always. size 12. Always. 
All right, so they're always size 12, and uh, I'll try them. I'll see if I like them for like a day in the gym. But if not, I'm gonna put them on eBay and we'll see what an Ultra Boost goes for. You guys can help me out on the pricing on this. Size 12 was great size men's, you know, slip on like no laces Ultra Boost shoe. Let me know what I should price this thing out of. All right, we've got two more garage sales before the day is over. And I think one of them is down here. And then we'll be in taco status pretty soon. Which I'm pretty sure we're at TLP. The one belt, I was looking at the belt buckles on eBay, and man, the Kiss belt buckles that are around that era that are really cool. Park here, there's a garage shelf right there. Uh, but the Kiss belt buckles sell for like crazy money. Now this is not a Kiss belt buckle, it's a Leonard Skinner one, but it's got the same kind of theme. And uh, I really think this is gonna be a home run. So um, we'll be looking at that one pretty soon as being the main driver of today. This, this is a garage sale right here. It doesn't look that great, but we'll, we'll check it out. All right, that garage sale. I picked up this bag. That's right, bags to bucks. You guys got to buy my bag guide. I'm telling you right now, missing out. All right, this is $2. This is a, this is a canvas leather Eddie Bauer, right? Not, not the strongest brand. However, with the right kind of keywords, this should sell 50 plus all day. It's a weekender bag. Yes, canvas, leather accents. And these are real leather, not junky, stupid leather. So yeah, 50 plus bag right here, $2. We're here at uh, this community-wide garage sale thing. It looks kind of crazy, but I see an interesting helmet on the ground right there. If that's Bell, that would be really worth it. If it's anything else, then maybe not. All right, let's take a look at this. All right, so I did buy the red helmet that was on the ground. It's an SR200. I don't know what the brand is, but I'll check it out. It could be Shoei, could be Vega, could be all kinds of weird things. Could be Climber, who knows? But we'll see, two bucks. So yesterday, I uh, bought a helmet at a garage sale, like first thing in the morning. It was a uh, garage sale open that was like maybe five minutes late. There was a $10 helmet there, it was a Bell. Um, it was a Bell vintage helmet, I'll, I'll put it as that. People in the green room know what it is. Um, but yeah, that helmet, as of this morning, it's only been less than 24 hours. Actually, it's been 24 hours. Has, it's on auction, it's got $230 bid on it already. And it still got like six days left, so it's crazy. Um, yeah, money in the bank. Dude, so there's a new that? taco shop like right here. E-Money, you don't want to try it out? Nope. Why? Because I want something that I know. Something good. Maybe I like in the middle of the week. Okay. So we can't try new tacos today because E-Money won't let me. Oh no. E-Money. No it's way. almost like you don't care. Savers. <laughs> Emerson, you're so impatient. <laughs> All right, E-Money, what'd you get, man? So we did a pair of Chacos. Not just a pair of Chacos, probably the best pair of Chacos. No, Z2s oh, are better. Okay, so these are Z1s? Z these are Z1s. Hold on, okay, so a pair of Chacos, right? Uh-huh. Z2? Z1. Those are Z2s? Z1s. Just kidding, Z1s, all right. How much you buy them for? Uh, 14. These are 14. Nice. And really good bottoms. We use the 30% off coupon. Those will probably sell for around 60, 70 bucks. Yep. And then, and then we have some we LG road shoes. Treats. Yeah. Really good condition. Nice. Uh, how much you spent on those? Seven. Seven? Yep. Should sell for around 50 plus. About 50 locally. Nice. All right, here at Taco Deli. Just parked front spot. Front spot, eat money. So we're here at Taco Deli. It's pretty busy, but the inside room is pretty good, so we're going to order some food and we'll see you in a bit. Right there. <laughs> All right, our tacos have arrived, man. 3D vision right here, look at this. Keeping it really healthy, look at that. All right, and we got some beans too. Taco Deli is done, how are those tacos? Great, where are we going? Uh, we're gonna go find a mailman, but I saw one, a little tiny truck, mail truck way down there, and I gotta give him three packages. Oh man, oh there it is, I see it, it's right there. It's on the side, it's right parked on the side, way up there on some building. We gotta get to it, E-Money. Oh, oh yeah. look at that, here we go. Yes. All right, oh, but there's no one in the trucks. What the hell? We gotta wait. Uh, 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 uh. Are they having barbecue nearby or something? What are these people doing? I don't know. All right. Where are they? That failed. I know, they're not even here. <clears throat> Stupid mailman. Oh, man. Well, that was, at least we tried. See you later, boxes. There are the boots in that one. $11 boots sold for $110. We're back at the Hustler Casa. We're at Emerson's Casa, really. His garage is so much cleaner than mine. But I do have a gym in my garage, so anyways. But his garage is looking like this. I thought, I thought it was a pretty solid hustling day. e money wasn't it a solid hustling day? Yeah, it's been a lot better than the past ones. That's, that's right. All right, man. So anyways, uh, that's pretty much it. We'll see you on the next Bone to Hustler video. I hope you had fun. So uh, hit the like button, and I'll see you on the next one. Take it easy. Goodbye.